everyone, my name is Yulin and I'm currently a third year rising senior at Northeastern University and today I'm going to show you guys how I take notes on my iPad using Notability. Um, just to note, my dog is behind me in my room so if you hear any random noises, that is Moose. So before I get right into the video, I did want to mention there is a Notability giveaway going on and so stay tuned till the end of the video to see the details on that. That aside, let's get right into it. The app that I use to take notes is obviously Notability. I've been using it for years and love it. And to start off, basically just a little bit on how I organize my notes. So I use the dividers for which semester I'm in and then the subjects for which courses I'm taking those semesters. And then outside of school, I'll separate it by personal and business. But then going right into how I take notes, I think I can split it up into kind of two parts. The first is annotating and the second is actually note taking. First things first, annotating. The first document is something I had for my Korean language class last semester. As you can see, I just like wrote all over it. I wrote like the translations, highlighted words that were especially hard for me or phrases, things like that. I'll pretty much download anything that I can digitally if possible, like the PDF version. As you can see, I also used it for the Korean workbook that they offered and I just downloaded the Korean version. Textbooks especially, I'll read it on there and then I'll highlight. And then obviously, like I mentioned, lecture notes are a huge thing. A lot of them will include like problems to solve, especially for like finance classes, things like that. And then another thing that I like to use is the note switcher function, but I'll actually use it within the same PDF of the textbook. A lot of the textbooks have problems to solve, but they don't give you space to solve it within the textbook. And so I'll use the note switcher function to add that same file next to it and solve the problems next to it. But then moving on to the actual note taking part. Say the biggest thing when I'm taking notes is that I always use the zoom feature. It's just the easiest way to take notes, especially on an iPad. But these days I've been using the text tool and the scribble function to take notes now just because it's easier. I don't have to stress about my handwriting. So here I'm just showing more practically. I'll usually take notes with the note switcher side by side with the textbook and take notes that way because usually I'm taking notes from a textbook. So that was a pretty quick but also still very detailed summary of how I take my notes for college and hopefully that was helpful. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments. If you guys want more videos like this, let us know in the comments below. But with that aside, it is time for the giveaway details. Notability is having a giveaway and there are going to be three winners. The first place winner is going to get an Apple iPad mini, an Apple pencil, a year of Notability Plus, and some Notably swag. And the second and third place winner are going to get a year of Notability Plus and some Notability swag. So in terms of how to enter the giveaway, first, subscribe to our YouTube channel, just hit that subscribe button down below. Second, like this video, so click that thumbs up button. Third, all you have to do is record a 10 to 20 second video with your phone, camera if you want to be fancy. You can get as creative as you want, but you just have to record a 10 to 20 second video of yourself talking about why you love Notability or how you use Notability, whether you use it for school, work, or whatever else. And then make sure to submit that video file to the link in our description box below. But all you have to do are those three things and you'll have a chance to be one of the three winners of this giveaway. So good luck and thanks for watching. Bye!